playgrounds, uh, fitness centers, and uh, bowling alley. Bowling alleys are allowed to reopen. They're breathing a sigh of relief uh, since March, but uh, movie theaters will continue to close and they'll have to play this waiting game. The owner of Red Cinemas, uh, Marty Cotis, is wondering and wants to know the data behind why they can't reopen. What we'd like to see is some science and data behind these decisions. Marty Cotis owns Red Cinemas in Greensboro. He made this Facebook post in frustration after Governor Roy Cooper announced movie theaters can't open under Phase 2.5 Friday. I think it's important that we have leaders that makes decisions, logical decisions based on science. And, data. and right now, I, for the life of me, understand why our theater, all of the safety precautions we put in place, not considered safe. Coda spent a quarter million dollars making coronavirus safety additions that likely won't be put to use until at least October. I actually was ex not expecting it. Greensboro downtown yoga studio owner Summer Sides was shocked when Governor Cooper announced the state eased restrictions allowing her studio to reopen. Gyms and other indoor exercise facilities can Governor open Cooper said fitness centers can operate at 30% capacity, something um, Sides says isn't worth at, doing. What's it going to cost to pay our instructor for that class? What's it going to cost to have the member management software? Some of those things that we had stopped paying for. Like, well, if we're only making a small amount. Sides will only open for private sessions for the time being. And CODIS won't have any new showings or long concession lines anytime soon. And I've reached out to the governor's office to get more details on how they decide what businesses will and will not open this Friday. And the National Association of Theater Owners is petitioning lawmakers to offer more relief for cinemas.